Hey everybody, Hidden Object Guru here, back for more Enigmatis, the Ghosts of Maple Creek. I want to say Maple Creek every single time. What is wrong with me? Uh, regular expert? No, I think we'll be doing regular mode. Oh, hey, we're doing Hamilton's uh, case. Cool. Three days in this eerie town. Countless interviews. And I haven't elicited one word about Emily from the preacher's mindless flock. What's your story, preacher man? Why can't I get a reading on you? Emily, we were supposed to meet here on our date. And now you're lost. And I'm helplessly searching for you. There's something off. Something I'm missing. But what? Is that her car or is that my car? Because it would be weird if I had a pink caddy. Maybe. Uh, kind of neat that we're uh, doing the backstory, though we know it doesn't end happily. Emily gets killed. Cute. Uh, he fails to catch the preacher. It's really kind of a downer. Uh, uh, I'm busy, can't you see? Yes, yes, a tire pump. $17 will be fine. Um, it's that evil preacher. So, you are leaving, Master Detective. Wow, what a dick. So, you are leaving, Master Detective. Ugh. Uh, uh, I'm busy, can't you see? So, yes. it's it, we're in this weird and frustrating position where we see the serial killer right there, and we, the player, knows know that he's a serial killer. We're not allowed to do anything about it. That's true. Ah, there we go. Weird place to keep your cash, but, you know. Uh, no. Ah, there we go. And now I need another dollar bill and one of them. Alexander Hamilton $10 bills. I found a $2 bill? Seriously? Alright, no, I'm just gonna find fives, I guess. But he said I needed $17. Seriously, who has a $2 bill? Weird, right? Oh. Really didn't see where it could be over there, but... I'm not one for literally... For littering, normally. <coughs> but I feel like it, would s like it would save us a whole lot of time if I just tossed this stuff out of the car, right? Ugh. Alright, it's got to be around here somewhere. Or maybe it doesn't. Oh, a coin. Nice. Wait, was I supposed to be looking at coins? Alright, so there's nothing up here. I still need two coins and a $5 bill. What is wrong with me? How did I miss this much? Alright. Come on, you can't be that far. I got you. Shut up. Oh, why couldn't I have just found a $10 bill? Seriously, though, I've only got $13 there and some change. That's not going to be enough. So is there a coin I missed? There doesn't seem to be. Oh, there it is. Wow, that was a, I, it was a very poor performance on my first puzzle. That was not $18. Did I find three fives or two fives? No, I found two fives and three dollars. Did I just have five dollars already? Uh, uh, I'm busy, King. <laughs> I'm busy. Take the key and get the pump yourself. You were the worst, Burr. Oh, I've got a dollar coin in 1981. That doesn't have a... Who was on the dollar coin in 1981? I really wish I knew that. Of course, I don't know who's on it now. Uh, well, in Canada, it's the Queen, but, you know, everything, it's always the Queen in Canada. Ah, there's the car jack. When you say chess, you mean chess board, right? Yes, you did. T letter, as opposed to the letter T. No, you mean the same thing? Oh, okay. There's a crossword, there's a dart. 
When you say bait, is this another one of those situations where you actually mean a lure? It was. See, I remember that from earlier in the game. Uh, you don't want the hot dog or the donuts or that nonsense. Okay. Uh, fire extinguisher pressure gauge. Pressure gauge would have a little... Oh, there's the fire extinguisher. There's a car. So I need a basketball, a wiper, and a pressure gauge. Basketball should not be hard. They're very distinctive. It's not the football, obviously. Out oh, there it is. It's a miniature basketball. Pressure gauge has to have a dial on it. There it was. Now we just need a wiper. That's a brush. That's a... Wait, didn't we need to find a windshield wiper before? That's uh That is kind of a wiper, but... Uh... Yep. And once again, it was along the bar of something. Oh, you game. Oh, there's a pump. Which is what I was here for in the first place, come to think of it. Lemon syrup, vanilla syrup. Oh, it's a puzzle. Oh, I did not know it was not turned on. Ah, there we go. Oh. That's a p kind of power cord I've never seen. Same on both sides. Weird. Right, let's just go uh, get the car fixed. So I like that I also stole the crowbar from this guy, because this guy is a uh, terrible word I want to use. All right. You make a strong point. Uh, what, uh, okay. Damn. Oh, wow. Yeah, I'm not on his side either. He's a creep. Sorry. I was about to check my map for places I could go next, and then I remember the game doesn't have a map that teleports you. Because, yeah, they made a real flaw in this one. No, I got nothing. Yeah, well, that part I figured out. <laughs> really? Yeah. Put some visual signifiers in, guys. Now, what have we got? Typewriter keys and a picture of a house. Find me here. Um, is that really going to go well? I'm busy. You want to talk? Talk to the preacher. How can I help you, detective? By stopping serial killing. I'm looking killing. for an abandoned cottage near Maple Creek. I know the place. Why don't I draw you a map? And then try to serial kill you later on. But first, can you get me a cup of coffee with milk and sugar from the vending machine, please? Has he switched what side he does the belt on, or are they just showing a 180 degree flipped version of him? I think we know the answer. Oh, right. I have to find the power cable. Whoops. Uh, makeup compact. Yep. Crumpled paper. Yep. Sticking plaster? Do you mean a band aid? I think you might mean a band aid. Wow, that music cut off abruptly, didn't it? the hell was that? Oh, car brush. Hey, we need finally did need the car brush. Now we need the football this time. Pencils, cables, duck. Oh, there's the duck. And there's the cables. Pencils? No, those are cigarettes. Uh, okay, we'll come back to that. Calculator, sticking plaster. I still think that might mean a band-aid, but I have no idea. I mean, I, have no, I see no sign of one. No, you don't mean any of these stickers. So I'm pretty sure. Uh, yeah, I got nothing here, guys. Car freshener? Oh, well, it's always a tree. It could be shaped like anything, but it's always a tree. Wait, I thought I got the cables. That was power cord cables was a different thing. Okay. Pencils. Those were not pencils. That was a compass. And now we're back to the sticking plaster. It was a band-aid. They meant band-aid. Or um, adhesive strip, if you will. Although, you know, now that I think about it, I guess adhesive plaster is as valid a uh, thing as any. I will take a coffee with uh, milk and sugar. Oh, I see. 
This moves all three. This just moves two. Okay. And is that sugar? What is that ice? Oh, that's ice cubes. Ugh, I'm a dummy. All right, I can move two this way. All right, so I need that to be one more to the right. No, I needed it to be way more to the right. Coffee with milk? No. All right. Small coffee, milk, and sugar. And this has to be nothing and sugar, so... Yes! Whew! That took a while, huh? Let's hope we don't have to do that puzzle again. Hey, I'm preacher man. I'm working on the map for you. How's that Enjoy. cup of coffee with thanks for the coffee, detective? And here's your map. The... Oh, sorry. Damn it, I missed what you saying. Uh, at least I know where to go now. There's the lookout, there's the church, so down our farm. Okay, well, it's the same house. Do I just use my car for that? I feel like I'm gonna... Yeah. Awesome. How it stopped being first person there, and I just jumped into the third person. Well, I thought it was awesome. Ooh, a hidden object scene. How scandalous. Padlock. Wicker basket. Nope, that was a rake. Wicker basket. It just means the art style look a little different on this one. Like a little grainier, a little rougher. I feel like this was drawn by a different person than the one responsible for most of the rest of the game. I'm not saying it's necessarily worse. It's just weird, uh, ki given the game we've been playing up until this point. Shovel. Pickaxe. I didn't need a pickaxe. Cleaver? No. Hat. Uh, chains and a nest. Chains and a nest. you need a broom? You do not. Caterpillar? Also no. Brushwood. Right there. Padlock chains. Scythe pliers fork. Padlock chains, scythe, pliers, fork. Ah, there's the scythe. Padlock chains, fork, nest. Padlock chains, padlock. How are chains this hard to find? Ah, there we go. I really didn't think those were chains. They meant pitchfork. When they said fork, they were needlessly confusing. And there's the nest. Yay! Apparently that bat is a big fan of that nest. I don't know if that's literally true, or if he just hangs out near it. Uh, or I could just go up to the window and push it down. Nail puller! Oh, good, we have to do every one. They really did get better after this game, didn't they? I mean, I'm not trying to complain. I've really enjoyed Enigmatis, but it has some uh, parts that really uh, stuck in my craw and made the game more difficult than it should have been. And they're all fixed in Enigmatis 2, which is just a masterpiece. Which is so nice to get me here. Oh, crap. I'm probably not going to use the note from my lady friend for kindling. You really don't just want to kick that open? Ah, there we go. And butter knife, please. Don't have a lighter, though, which is probably a mistake. Oh, I'm also going to need lumber, I'm guessing. Nice, hidden object scene. Oh, yes. Uh, okay, so that's why I need the three pieces of cutlery. And there's one of them. No, it was a poker. Uh, monogram. Bugle, watch. Uh, bugle, no, that's a horn. Sorry, that's a trophy. A bugle is a horn. Um... Seriously, you told me the bugle was visible. Oh, I could have just clicked on it through the hole in the glass. 
that was... Okay, yeah, technically that was visible. I can't argue with your logic there. Pipe. Making this, I think, the eighth pipe I grabbed in the game. Enigmatis. Don't know what a cockade is. Might have to take a hint on that one or click on everything in the level. Which would not be my uh, preference, obviously. Matches sauce boat. Do you mean gravy dish? You do. Uh, magnifying glass. It's fascinating how many times we just get this weird word and I'm like, am I the one who's using a colloquial? Co Apparently I'm not good at using the word colloquial. Uh, but anyway, am I the one using the, word, uh, the colloquialism or do the people from Poland just honestly not know? All right, so it's covered when I do that. So it has to be over here somewhere. There you are. And of course, the last item is the one I don't know. Well, why wouldn't it be? Uh, so yeah, we're going to take 10 seconds for me to just randomly click on stuff, hoping I figure out what it is, and then we're just going to take the thing. Uh, no belt buckle, no bone, no bouquet, no. Is that... It was that badge. Okay. We're going to accept that and move forward. Can I get some lumber, please? Some lumber would be nice. Ah. Ah, good. Lumber. Pickaxe. Nice. Oh, the broom. I saw that. Noose. I clicked on. Axe. I also clicked on. Wow, I did a lot of clicking on stuff I was going to need to grab later. Oh, it's a weasel. Fox? No, weasel. Ferret? Might be a ferret. I'm not good at the differences between these things. Beetle brush. That is a caterpillar, not a beetle. That is a beetle. Uh, brush I'm not seeing right away. But uh, fingers crossed. Huh. There we go. Cup. Pot. That is not a pot, you dummy. Oh, that was a pot. I thought that was a, one of those giant wine bottle things. Um, a cask? No, not a cask. You were also the wrong word. Where am I thinking of? Anyway, let's just get the second log and then we'll focus on this brush. Oh, it was that kind of brush. I always think it's going to be the scrubbing brush, not the painting brush, and I'm almost always wrong. Although you could have said painting brush game. Just saying. Oh my god. It's Emily's stuff. It's her backpack. And her sleeping bag. Damn. She was here. Emily, where are you now? Yikes. Hey, another one. And, uh, oh, I have to open the box lid. Jesus, what a downer. Uh, toothbrush, there we go, corn flakes, chocolate, flashlight, headboard, headband. Flashlight, I'm not seeing the headband. There's a necklace, though. What does a headband look like? Like that, apparently. Uh, yarn ball cruet? See, th what are you doing to me, game? I don't want to be a jerk about this, but what the hell is a cruet? And more importantly, am I coming back later for that puzzle piece to find in a, uh, in the top left here by the knitting needles? Because I feel like... I've, I've got to be, right? Because that looks unbelievably out of place. That was a cruet. So, is there some place where they call a thermos a cruet? I actually want to look that up. All right, let's do this. We can go upstairs? Still no. Russell, Virtus S. Russell, Sapienta. Um... Virtue and knowledge? No, that can't be right. I just think of sapient. Awareness, knowledge. Emily has a pendant that unlocks this box. I'll hold on to it until I find her. That's probably smart. Yep, we're coming back for that piece later. Uh, okay. I got a knife. That's awesome. Another spoon. Can I pry this lid up or do I have to find the soldier? I can pry the lid up. Nice. Let's go pick a lock. Oh. Oh, wait. The fireplace poker. Maybe I can use the fireplace poker to find... Oh. 
Well, it wasn't a completely crazy idea. What the high thing high up? The thing high up. I need the fireplace poker for that. Yay! It's another shield piece. Still just two of four though. All right. And seriously, Emily, you picked the worst place for a rendezvous. Oh, let's uh, let's rendezvous in the creepy old mansion where Jason definitely lives. I was trying to click on the uh, telescope, and I accidentally got something I had already uh, been told to click on. Uh, sorry, something else I had been told to click on. Seriously, though, if there isn't a, a Jason around here somewhere, I'm going to be very surprised. And yes, I know there's technically already a Jason type because there's a, a serial killing priest, but, you know... He's the exact same age as he was before, so his demon worship is obviously working. Uh, cone. Cone, flute, fork. Oh, the flute! I remember seeing you earlier. Hey, there's the fork I needed. Uh, stamp. What kind of stamp? There we go. Cone. Do you mean pine cone? You probably don't. Oh, hey, let's see if I can... Oh, so it's covered up now. They did mean pine cone. It's right there. Yeah, these these unclear words are not blowing me away. All right, let's fix this up. Yep. Uh, you go here. You go here. No, here. And I'm missing another knife. One, two, three, four, ah, five. Let's put you next to this knife. Why are so, there we go. Obviously, that is supposed to be facing that way. Oh, are these supposed to be facing left or right? Be great if there was a uh, clearly drawn thing to tell me which way the these are supposed to be facing. Like, is that information I'm just supposed to have? Ah! Okay. Everything's facing the right way, so I guess these ones were... No, those ones aren't wrong. Huh. Okay, facing left, facing left, facing left, facing left, facing left. See? Oh! No, that's facing left. See, like, this is the... Oh, I didn't notice there was also bowls. Please don't judge me too harshly. Now we're done, right? Yeah, I noticed. I'll take instructions. Oh. <clears throat> there, there were instructions. Let no man judge me. Um, so what haven't I done? Like, do we all see this? All of this is arranged correctly. The forks, the knot. Somehow I had a knife backwards. I didn't even see it. Still don't. But you know, we got the key. That's what matters. Let's move on this jerk. All right. Oh. I'll be back for you later. Creepy. The Hall of a Thousand Dolls. Fire? No. I was about to say, is that a fire extinguisher? No, it's just, uh, tassels. This is... Why would you want to stay in this place? Ghosts. Jasons. These are both very real possibilities. Alright. Uh, obviously you go... Am I not switching these? Oh. Alright, so there's the orange. The inner one luckily does not move. So we are good. Alright, so I need you for that guy. There's your devil tail. Uh, there's your griffin. Was the griffin already half done? He was not. 
could not be more wrong. Oh, it's part of a tree. Or to use the vernacular. Oh, it's a tree. And if you know what that was a reference to, it's kind of oblique, but if you know what that was a reference to, I changed uh, the words, but the context should make it clear. Be the first subscriber to mention uh, what that Oh, It's a Tree was a reference to in the uh, space below this video. Boom, you win a prize. Maybe this very game, or maybe another game. Uh, so the disappearance of all those women. Fine, I'm to start by melting the tin in the fire. Wow. Awesome. Oh, more pieces of the typewriter. Yeah, well, we're finding out more about his history. That's for sure. Well, who could have guessed that? I will work on that. Okay, what's going on here? What did I just find? Emily's casket. I don't like you calling that a casket. I mean, I know she is dead, but meant referring to it that way is kind of... <laughs> Puzzle piece? Yeah. Makeup compact. Pin cushion. So she was going to do some sewing while she was here. That's ab apparent. Banana peel? No. Leave the banana peel. Take take the apple core. Leave the banana peel. That would be the uh, tin can. There it is. Uh, the worst and most off-putting reference to the Godfather imaginable. That is a really nice camera for... And with the telescoping lens and all that for 1981. I feel like that might be slightly out of... Uh, so, sorry, slightly anachronistic. Thank you! Still need another one, though. Hey, more to do with the poker. Cool. Um, not clear what, though. And we're in that weird situation where there's no... Like, nothing to tell me... There's no map to tell me where a new hidden object scene might be. So I just have to go looking for one and failing that, use the hint key. But hey, at least the hint key works. I could be uh, stuck as in a certain... Okay. Uh, what was that game called? Ah, yes. Questarium. Sinister Trinity. Oh, look. It has broken eyes. I will hit it with a poker. That was not smart. You grow up in a hurry. Wow. Uh, Alright. No, nothing there. Nothing here. I do like rocking that back and forth, I won't lie. Alright, hit me with a hint. Never mind. Sure, why not? Oh, come on. Whatever. Uh, anyway, uh, yes, Quisterium Sinister Trinity. Where are they just, uh, they said to themselves, Hey, what if, what if we make a game where the hint button... Are you ready for this? Here's my pitch. The hint button just doesn't work. Uh, and it didn't. And yet, you know what? I muscled my... Th nice. And nonetheless, I muscled my way through that game, and now it's one of my most weirdly... Uh, oh, the thing I have to melt in the fire. Uh, boop. And what's underneath the tin? I will use the poker to find out. Oh, it's got a different symbol underneath. Neat. What was I saying? Yes. Um, I muscled my way through that game, and now it's a very popular video over on the channel because uh, plenty of people would like to also beat that game. Uh, keys are misplaced or agents correct. Password. Some keys are fixed. Each number shifts to the corresponding letter. Pull the lever to test the current setting. Okay shifts the corresponding letter. So, G, C, D, E, F, G. Oh, okay, I get it. And it has to spell a woman's name. Okay. Oh. The roller is locked? There must be a lever? What? Alright, how do I... Ah, here it is. Okay, um, that's fine. I like that the um, six has a dot under it, so you, it's not upside down. But so do the eight and the O, which really can't be upside down, because, you know, they're the same both ways. No? Is that not? Anyway. 
I find it weird. All right, so we can't move that. Are we trying to spell Russell? R U S S E. We are not. Margaret. M A R G A R E T. Mar. Oh yeah, Margaret. All right, so um, let's see. Mar is well. I can move both three. Oh well, let's start with the. Uh, actually, these one is already in the right place, isn't it? Uh, and so is the E. So this has to become a T. So let's move uh, eight down from, I want to say, L? Yeah, L. Yes! Okay. Now we need A. Oh, but the A has to be the zero, doesn't it? Actually, there is no A. Uh, okay, that's weird. V, W, X, Y, Z, A. Is that right? Yes! Alright, now we just have to hit Mar. Oh, now I have to do A again. Uh, how many do we have to be down from S? I guess it would be two more. Do we have a nine? We don't. We have an eight. Okay, so that last one was wrong. We'll come back to it. Um, M-A-R. So it can't be a zero. Oh, well, this has to be a zero, obviously. Uh, okay, we need this to be... Q-R-S-T. Damn it. Hmm. How the hell are we going to get to a T? Wait. All right. Uh, now we're done. We just have to get the M, which is three past... No, it's not three past any of these. God damn it. Uh, L-M-N-O-P. Jargarit. That would have been great. We were so close. All right, so what am I doing wrong? So A8 has to be right. 7K has to be right. Okay. The E is good. Um, because it's not like I have, uh... The X isn't useful for anything. The L and the F. Okay. Wait. M. Alright, so let's look for ones before M. So F, I need G, H, I, J, K, L. I need six. Which is a lot. Oh, it is. It's the six. And then I just put the X here. Alright, that was embarrassing. Yeah. Didn't occur to me I could use the X. Uh, keep following the preacher last night. He set off his forest. Hideout. What game are you playing, old man? Who is, of course, still the exact same, same age. 159 years later. Well, at least um, my character won't be surprised when he turns out to be behind this all because, you know, I've seen plenty of people's do people documenting his evil. All right, let's make a puzzle. Uh, no. Yes. You obviously go here. I mean, that could not be more obvious. Uh, what about you? Here? Yes. I'm going to Tetris the F out of this thing. Uh, yep. Was that right? That was right. Huh. That was just a weird guess. All right, let's keep this going. No, that's not right. Um, what's going on here? That looks like top left to me, doesn't it? Okay, I was a little off, but you know. Not terribly. Uh, that would be it. Well, that one I know right away. Oh, they're building the church. I assume. Or is it this mansion? Are they building this mansion? Yay! Now, I talk a lot about my love of Golgo 13, but that, uh... Mafat Conspiracy. It's not a great game, but it's a solid game. Also, it has a really good ending. 
And it's, uh... Weirdly, back in the day before emulation. I beat both of those games, which was exactly as hard as it sounds. They're very tough games. Really, that wasn't the soldier I wanted. Huh. Uh, any idea where the picture goes? Probably the study, right? Just logically? No, I guess not. Like, I got this picture, but I have no idea what I'm supposed to do with it. Over the mantelpiece, apparently. Alright. Don't have much of an excuse on that one. Yes! More evidence. I failed to vote last years of my life to what I considered to just cause, yeah. Elemental evil. Do 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 do. Thank you. Center's control. Maple Keep is his creep is his realm. Now I said Maple Keep. What is going on with me? Priest's robes. The bell is the medium. What? Damn. That's a good, that's some good art for 1771. Find a way to drain life force from his puppets to immediately revive. Break the medium and kill him with his own weapon. Awesome. Right, I've got the photograph of it, remember? I know this place. I've been there before. From the very beginning, I sensed there was something off about that preacher. And you were I just right. I couldn't figure out what. What is he? An immortal demon? I don't know. And I don't care. All I care about is Emily. And I pray I'm not too late. A, you're definitely too late. B, I gotta say, this detective found a lot of evidence to sit on for 30 years. Hopefully there'll be some explanation for that. Jesus! That's horrible. My God. Uh, do I take any of these coins or cameos or glasses or cameras? No. I'm looking for a skein, which is, uh, is that a thing for weaving? Anyway, I'll figure it out. Um, there's a wig. Okay, there's a job on hand. Candle stub. Yep. Stone owl, yes. Stalactite, right over here. Bracelet, uh, is it still gonna be on one of their wrists? Maybe not. We'll circle back around. Oh no, there it is. Not on a wrist, though. Uh, gourd spider beads. There's the gourd, there's the spider. There's the yarn. Oh, skein is what they call a ball of yarn. I had no idea. Uh, fang fish, I saw the fish. Uh, fang is here? No, that's a horn, I guess. All right. Um, hmm. Gourd. Is that a gourd? Ah, there it is. Uh, beads fang. Beads fang. Huh. So around the necklace is not beads. The necklace, sorry, around his neck is not beads. Um, those are teeth. You know, I keep looking for a necklace. It could just be a... Oh, pardon me. It could just be a pile of beads. Oh, no, it was just a pile of beads. All right, let's find this fang and get the H out of here. Oh, there it is. Yay! Fang! This is for the memories. Yeah, I'm not proud of myself. Would you like a skeletal hand, my dear? That was so creepy and off-putting. What? Emily. God damn it. The necklace. I, the necklace. I can use it to open the thing, which is where she keeps her tools for breaking chains. Wait, that was a very stupid thing to say. Uh, demonic. All right, we'll break it then. Oh, right back here for the pickaxe. The pickaxe I saw right away. And I love that. You know what? Let's let's find 11 items also. Let's not just uh, immediately go and save her life. Uh, and wow. Uh, two games now in the past couple of weeks I've played that featured a stupidly oversized uh, thimble. Thimble's so big it doesn't even make sense. There's the arrow. That's not the arrow? Oh, this is the arrow. That's a spear, I guess. Looks a lot like an arrow for my money. Alright, um, coin purse. Blue stone. Coin purse, coin purse. There you are. 
Brooch. Yeah, so Brooch is just how they smell. Smell. Oh, wow. I'm making fun of them, and I can't even use the word, right word. Apparently, someone told all of Europe that Brooch is how you spell the word brooch. I can't explain it. Don't understand it. But here we are. Feather. Z. Uh, all right. Perfumes. So, like, a bunch of bottles or just the one? Just the one. Um, seriously, all I need is a turtle, guys. Help me out here. Uh, oh, it's a picture of a turtle. Should have guessed. Thank you, kind sir. Chong. And two. No, we're just doing the one. Okay. You've gone too far, detective. Ow! No priest. You haven't gone will too not far be enough. Forgiven. Oh, we gotta kill this guy. Ah. Luckily, he threw us in here with a pickaxe, which I'm not a super villain. But I see a downside to that logic. I never opened the casket. I failed you, and for that I'm sorry. God damn it! I returned to Maple Creek after a few years in hiding to avenge Emily's death. Disguised as a hermit, I watched him in silence. Looking for the weapon. Waiting for the right moment to strike. You were not to blame for my failure. You did what you considered right. But the game's not over yet. And if Russell wasn't wrong, then I've got the upper hand. Yours sincerely, Richard Hamilton. Damn. So that whole thing we played was just a letter that Richard was sending to the star of the game explaining his backstory. That's awesome. You know, I'm going to say, and this isn't, this is the furthest thing from a complaint, you know, slightly sketchy hidden object scenes aside... And, let's face it, terrible, terrible travel mechanics. Just awful travel mechanics. This is flat out one of the best hidden object games stories I've ever come across. It is. The first one's great. Psyched for the second one. Oof. Yeah, I was really blown away by this story. So, yeah. I like it. And, uh... Let's go play the second one over on the Xbox One. Yay. The hell? There's glass and ink, but who's that? Okay, now I'm just in the deep. Who's the little girl with the teddy bear? Abyss? Time Mysteries 3? Ah, we'll figure it out. I've got all the games after all. Alright, uh, so anyway, thanks for coming along with me on this journey. I've been the Hidden Object Guru. You probably know me better as Hunter Debuxferklum. If you've had a good time coming on this uh, journey with me, please like and subscribe. And if you have any Hidden ob Object puzzle related questions or news to share, uh, you can do it over at GC underscore Danny on Twitter. Um, that's it for this game, but, uh, you can join me for Enigmatis 2 elsewhere on the channel, or really any of the many other games I've played here. I'm doing an exclusive advanced playthrough of Demon Hunter 3. That, that'll be fun. Anyway, uh, I will see you there. Au revoir.